I turning to, under. Huh? I need to face you, but I'm before that even happens, you're getting this lapel and you're getting the choke. Because I, I think because I'm like this. <laughs> fasted like all day yesterday and then I finally broke down and had like a meal last night but I trained we rolled well like I rolled with you and then we rolled a bunch at 4 30 at the school I was dying for food training twice twice a day like in that humidity it's just different you know telling people I passed out because then yeah. they get worried about me and I do find or I just it's like I have to just just say it I passed out just so you know <laughs> we'll put it in the centrifuge and it'll spin it it's uh, really pretty interesting how it does it it spins it without doing anything else it'll separate it into two spots and you'll have the, the red blood cells on the one side and uh, the platelets will be transferred to the you know this other side of the cup here so your blood's got all the different components the red blood cells white blood cells um, the plasma itself, which everything is dissolved in. And then the platelets are the part that we're going for. The platelets, um, everybody knows of as the, the component that forms the blood clots. Um, so if you were to have a, an injury, say you cut your arm uh, and it started bleeding, the platelets would start to stick to the broken vessel wall and form a blood clot. So the, the bleeding would, would stop. And everybody really considers that as their role and they don't know all the other roles the platelets play. So this is all red blood cells, some a little bit over here, all the platelets in the plasma on this side, and we're going to draw all this up. We're going to take some of those red blood cells, a lot of people try to get pure PRP plasma, no red blood cells, and the fewer red blood cells you get, the fewer platelets you're going to get. So it's, it's okay to get some red blood cells in there, it's not a, not a big deal. two weeks and take it off but but uh, don't really train mm -hmm. so total a month till I see you the next time we'll do another PRP injection then you can go back to light activity mm -hmm. and then uh, do that for another month just like that before you go to sport. Mm -hmm. 